To recharge your Peugeot's battery, check that the speed selector is on mode P, and the engine is switched off. Then press on the back of the charger flap to open it, and ensure there are no foreign bodies on the vehicle's charge connector. White lights inside the charger flap will come on. First, connect the charge cable to the domestic socket. When the cable is connected, all the lights on the control box will come on, then only the green power light will stay on. Insert the pistol into the vehicle's charge connector. The lights inside the flap on the car, and the charge light on the control box, will flash green to indicate charge. If not, charging has not started. Repeat the procedure, checking that all connections are correct. At the same time, when the vehicle is plugged in, the following information is displayed on the digital cluster. Battery status in percent. Remaining range in kilometers. Estimated charging time. And the charging speed in kilometers per hour. After a few seconds, the digital cluster will enter sleep mode. The information can be displayed again by unlocking the vehicle or opening driver's door. Deferred charge settings are managed via the touchscreen or the energy widget. In the energy application, select the charge tab. Define the charging start time, then validate by pressing apply. The setting is stored in the system. Deferred charging can also be configured from a smartphone via the My Peugeot app. Charge completion is indicated when the green light on the control box and the green lights in the flap stop flashing. A red light in the flap indicates that the pistol is locked. To unplug the pistol from the charge connector, unlock the vehicle if it is locked. If your vehicle is unlocked, lock it, then unlock it. Finally, unwind the charging cable completely and never use it with an extension cable, power strip, conversion adapter, or with a damaged electric socket.